What's going on, beautiful people of YouTube? It's Rain Bean. Welcome to another episode of eBay slash Macari Game Deals Unboxing. That series I started up because I wanted to show you that you can game hunt online. You can get prices for games better than you can out in the wild sometimes. You can buy lots for reseller for whatever your little heart desires. I got four awesome packages here to open up, so sit back and relax. Let's check them out. so just like always with all these packages I put the price of what I paid for all these that's shipping included this first package eight dollars and 75 cents and you will see that it has been opened before I actually thought this was a different package second I, I saw what it was I taped it back up so I didn't really go through it I just saw the first thing on top and I was like oh this is not that package that I need to be worrying about so with that said eight dollars and 75 cents this was an eBay auction believe it or not and I caught this one at a decent time it was like nine o'clock at night and i was like oh i don't understand why people don't see that specific game you know being worth the whole lot and you're getting all these other games additionally for for nothing um i hopped right on it i put a max bid in and it didn't even take that it just went to the minimum amount of that auction and i think it was five dollars and the shipping was three dollars and 75 cents uh, or at least whatever it calculated so with that said what do we got here for eight dollars and 75 cents let me show you what we got here this is awesome right here. I'm, it's it's obviously it's not going to be the most insane, impressive lot, but this is a prime example on how you add games to your collection, and it doesn't cost you anything. It, I mean, this is going to cost me virtually nothing but a little bit of time, and that time is very easily made. Uh, so what we got here is a Sega Genesis lot, and inside we're going to see some games here, and there's two of which that I did not have, so I'm going to be able to add those to the collection, and then I'll have one that'll just be a bundler game. So first off, we got Monopoly. It's basic, it's Monopoly, it's nothing special. Uh, this one, I already had, so I'm not too worried about that. Like I said, I'll bundle that with a system later on. Championship Pool, believe it or not, I didn't have this. So I'm adding that to the collection. No manual, but these are, like I said, not, not your most high-end games. This is just an, a way for me to add some games to the collection. Doesn't cost me anything, I'm, I'm not really you know out anything, which is, always nice next up well, another one that i didn't have and this one's chewed all up is a la la russa baseball I'll probably butchered that 95 this one looks like a dog got to it which is all right i saw the auction i saw the pictures of what it was this one is somewhat complete i suppose uh la russa i'm, I, I'm, not, I'm not too knowledgeable with with uh with baseball and whatnot and of course one that i already had of uh, was caesar palace this one complete falling out all over the places genesis uh cases while i like the clamshell th these things wear out so easily nothing you can really do about it but the, what makes this free what makes it where it doesn't cost me anything is i saw one loose game with it and i was like well i'll just resell that get my money back and get those games for free minnesota fats pool legend believe it or not this is a fairly uncommon uh genesis game it's it's not a high-end game complete in box it goes somewhere between 40 or 50 uh, but cartridge alone in the condition that it's at probably get 12 13 dollars you know free shipping take away the shipping in my fees it's exactly what i paid for all this so to get two games for free a couple games i can bundle with systems that's how you do it so let's move on to the next package so this box right here the next package up i paid 19 dollars and 50 cents this was another auction that i won I just got lucky like i said a little bit later times in the day you know i'd say after 10 11 o'clock i'm on eastern time pm I, I usually get pretty lucky with auctions but i never bid until you know right at the end i just don't like people to see more than one or two bids on an auction if i can help it hopefully there's no bids on there so you can be that last one you know a lot of people have that same strategy but for me it works out so 19 dollars and 50 cents this this box is pretty beat up <laughs> you can tell it's a recycled box they put the, the tape right here and all around it I do the same thing if a box, I mean, you can reuse a box three or four times depending on the condition it's in. So what did we get for $19.50? Let's check it out. I hope we got what I what I was uh, purchasing. <laughs> Some of these packages can sit, you know, unlike Macari, Macari, I can't let them sit that long. eBay, they can sit for a little bit, but 
Very rarely have I ever been duped. All right, here we go. All right, nineteen dollars and fifty cents. Was it worth it? So first up, we got the uh, was this the long box for uh, PlayStation One, the manual, if I'm not mistaken. I want to say that's what that is for for uh, long box PlayStation One game. I could be wrong on that. I I honestly can't even remember. Uh, I want to say that's the case. That actually, I think that may be PC. That's 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 pretty big. But anyways, moving on. Uh, we got a poster. What do we got in here? I like posters. I like to hang them up. I doubt I'm going to be hanging this up. This is just an insert. Uh, most likely to an EA sports game, as we can tell by the uh, multiple amounts of EA on there. We got another manual. Yeah, it had to have been a PC game earlier. Was that uh, Xenophobe Alien Bloodsport? Moving on to some decent stuff now. A copy of... I Actually, I don't even know if the game is in here. I can't remember. No, this is just the box for NBA Jam for the Game Gear. That's okay. I didn't have this in box. I'm one of the few people that collect boxed Game Gear games. Uh, so this is going to be one that I needed for the collection. A little bit beat up. That's okay. I'm not too worried about it. Uh, what's going to help me make my money back? Well, this is the game is not in here. Uh, this is just the manual and the uh, the cardboard box itself. But I will sell this separately as the manual and you know and the box itself make majority uh if not all of that back with that one that's actually in very nice shape for uh, battle toads double dragons very cool uh this is awesome this is this is really cool mortal Kombat for the game gear again i don't believe this comes with the game this is just yeah this is just the uh just the box itself perfectly okay with that that does not bother me at all i already have the game uh, and it's not an expensive game to begin with but to have it complete in box makes it quite a bit more uh, this is cool. This is one that I did not have for the collection, and that is uh, WWF Warzone, the box. I got the game, of course, but I did not have the box. Um, and it doesn't look like it includes the manual, so very nice. Keep in mind, I only paid $19.50 for this stuff, so we're already in the win. So anything we pull out of this box is definitely some extra. I can't, I can't fix that. Uh, so let's see. We got... A box for Bubsy for the uh, this is for the Sega Genesis here if I can open it up as you can see nothing inside but that's okay I might be able to sell this box separately I haven't looked at the price on what it goes for I'm pretty sure I have this complete already next up a box for Tetris 2 very cool I did not have this for the collection uh, this is one that I wanted. I am a huge fan of Tetris, the original game, and to have a box copy of Tetris 2 in pretty decent shape, mind you. It's got a little bit of damage at the front, but I've never been one of those people that really worry about that. So, for $19.50, we got this awesome box lot. We got Tetris 2, which I'm adding to the collection. Mortal Kombat, going straight to the collection. Bubsy, I already have it. I don't know if I'm going to you know, stick with the, um, with the cardboard style over the original clamshell. WWF Warzone making our money back. We got Battletoads Double Dragons and I am adding NBA Jam. So even if I don't make exactly all my money back, I'm getting all this for a ridiculous cheap amount. So that is awesome. Not to mention a few manuals. So moving on to our next package here. This one comes directly from eBay. The you know all of these are from eBay except for the final package. This one cost me $14. This is a complete resale lot right here. I bought all this just to resell. And again, when you see me open this up, you're going to be like, why does he buy these things? Because they sell. I've already sold three, I believe, from the last time we had one of these episodes. And you can tell it's nothing but Game Boy cases, man. I don't know why, but I sell the heck out of these. Look at this nice pink one right here. Game Boy Advance SPI. Uh, let's see. We got a Tony Hawk one right here. It's not official Nintendo. I may be able to sell that separately. I don't know. I'll have to check it out. Uh, but I, I have really good luck. Some people say they can't sell the cases. For whatever reason, I can. Um, again, I sold out of the last five that I got from the last episode we did this. I already sold three of them. Uh, this one was really nice right here. Uh, for what it is, this is the Pokemon Gotta Catch Them All with the yellow. I'm not sure what I'm going to ask on that one. Maybe somewhere between 20 25 bucks. I'm not sure. i got to see if there's others listed and how we want to go from there. That Velcro is a little bit worn. But... I still think that's pretty nice. That's going to cover this whole lot. Game Boy Advance SP. Game Boy Advance SP all day. These, I think these are all SPs, if I'm not mistaken. 
I always want to check inside too. You never know if they forgot something. Maybe slipped in a game that you don't realize. And then the final two. Another Game Boy Advance SP. And a red. So I got multiples of the same type. So for $14, I got all these cases. This one obviously being the nicest one of them. This is, or you know, I ain't going to say nicest. It's pretty dirty. But this one's going to fetch me the most out of all of them. Um, and then the rest will be complete resale. So this will get me my money back and all this will be additional profit later down the road when they sell. And I always tell people the cases, they don't sell immediately, but they do sell. It's definitely something that can sit, but stand strong on your pricing, put a best offer and you will be surprised they do go. So let's move on to the final package, which I'm very excited about. Originally, this was $40 plus $9 shipping, I believe. It could have been a few dollars less. Um, it was still a decent deal that had some watchers on it. And then they lowered the price on there to, I want to say, maybe like $35. And that's when I noticed it. And I sent an offer for, I think, $28 plus the $9 shipping. And I got a message back that says, they're holding off on that price for now. And then they were going to see, you know, if, if it was going to sell, which was completely understandable at $34, $35, whatever it was, plus a $9 shipping, it was still an excellent deal. This is where it kind of gets problematic for me being who I am. I've introduced a lot of people to Macari, a lot of people on that platform, you know, who deal with games. They know of me. They, they know at least of what I do. And this person recognized my name. You know, they saw the, the ring being from the YouTube, which is the, the username on there, I believe. And... I originally sent them that offer of $28, $29 they wanted to hold off. I saw that they sent me an offer back that said $29. It wasn't, it wasn't letting me accept it because it wouldn't go to my PO. And they said, well, we can change that around for you and have it sent to an, an, you know, an actual physical address. I only use my PO. And he was very kind. He was very awesome. And he says, you know, since it's ring bean, I'm going to let you have it for $33. And I'll cover the shipping. He completely didn't have to do that. I did not ask for it. I'm very grateful he did that, you know, because this is something I'm going to add to the collection and it's, and it's going to be awesome. But I will say as far as for this show goes, for this series, it, it, it's not the best example of getting a great deal because it's not going to happen for everybody. But it is in a sense that at that price that I was willing to pay the $28 um, plus the $9.50, which I tried to pay, it just did not go through because of the PO. It was a phenomenal deal. So until I find a way to buy anonymously on Macari, these things can happen. But again, I wouldn't have shown this had it still not been an amazing deal at the $33 plus the shipping. And then I, I tried to get it for $28, $29, and he was going to give that to me uh, plus the shipping. And that could have happened to anybody out there because it sat for a while. It was still an amazing deal. That's why I kind of want to show this package. So understand that. That's why I paid $33. I, I'm going to be truthful about it. I'm not going to say I paid what it was even though that would have been a good deal this is the story of what it is so enough blabbering let's go ahead and open this up and let me show you what's going on here so for thirty three dollars this was obviously an amazing deal again it would have been an amazing deal at the original price that i sent the offer of of twenty nine dollars plus the the nine dollar shipping i was more than willing to pay uh, because one of the things in here i will resell and make that money back and I'm adding something very awesome to the collection that I've been looking for for quite some time. This is a huge box. I don't know how I'm really going to open this. Oh, uh, let's see. This is going to be awkward on this camera here. Uh, very well packaged. This is obviously a not so common box due to what's being shipped in here. Ignore the Discord server going on in the background. That thing's always active. If you haven't joined that thing, join up. I'm always usually on it. If you ever had any questions for me or, you know, like to show pictures of the finds that you get or have questions on reselling, we're a pretty good community, so check that out. So anyways, awesome bubble wrap. That's always a good sign. All right. I will go, I will go out and say this. Uh, this, he included. He sent me a message and he said, hey, I know you're going after an N64 set. I'm going to throw this in. And again, he did not have to do that. I'm very grateful he wanted to this is not going to happen for everybody i don't expect it to happen for me but it does happen again i can't shop on macari anonymously i didn't think it would turn into what it has uh so for this this is not part of the deal thank you for this by the way i'm very very grateful to have this and this is a box copy if i can open it up i really don't want to sound like a dick or you know just douchey about this this is you know, this was still an amazing deal. I, you know, I can't help that something like this does happen. Um, 
But what we got here is Power Rangers Light Speed Rescue. He says it doesn't have the manual, but the game is in there. One that I did not have for the collection, and to have the box for it, very amazing. That is awesome. Thank you so much for that. So what could you have gotten for $35 plus $9.50 shipping? Or if he would have sent the offer, he most likely would have accepted it. Like I said, it sat for a bit. I think a lot of people were on the fence about it. It was an amazing deal at that price. Just one that I didn't want to pay. Everybody knows I like to be the Sheckler that I am. Let me see if I can pull this out and not destroy everything here. Oh, goodness. Such a small table. And you might be able to tell a little bit. This is very well packaged. They did a great job. Lots of excellent bubble wrap. Oh, goodness. I'm in love with the bubble wrap. Oh, you can already see it. I'm sure you can. I'm moving the whole table. It doesn't matter. I'm excited to get this thing open. i got to be careful. The Sega Genesis Model 3 with the box. This is not complete. He says it's just the box, and the box does have some damage. But check this out. We got the console itself. He says this has all been tested. I completely trust them on that one. Uh, decent, decent condition on that. Believe it or not, the Model 3s don't go for that much. You know, if you have the controller power pack, where you probably get about 40 bucks on eBay. Uh, we got a power pack right here, which I honestly, I think that may have turned some people off from the listing because in the description, it didn't state that it came with the power pack. It said it came with everything else, but I saw that this was in the picture. Um, again, let's see, we got the RF switch right there. But I believe I have the AVs to go with it. Copy of Sonic 2. So I'm already making a bundle out of this. And then one thing very special with it is a six button Sega controller. A little bit more uncommon than the standard three. Uh, so that's a nice plus. And then inside we got even more bubble wrap, which I love. So for now I'll say what, what we got a $45. That would have been an amazing deal. You get the box. There's no inserts. There's no manual. It's just a box. But I'm okay with that. This is an excellent display piece for me. One that I needed. I already got the Sega 3 already for $45. And then you would have probably gotten it cheaper had you sent the offer. That would have been an amazing deal. So with this lot, again, I'm extremely grateful that he gave me a phenomenal deal. Um, he did not have to do that. I actually told him that was not necessary, but he insisted. So I took it. Uh, I got it for $33, but again, at $45, $40, this would have been an amazing deal. You can resell your Sega, keep your box for free. If you needed uh, the six button, swap this out with a standard three and keep that for yourself. So I'm very happy about adding this to the collection. Same with the Power Rangers and everything else that I was able to pick up with this episode of eBay slash Macari Game Deals Unboxing. So with that said, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this episode. If you've enjoyed, hit that thumbs up button, and as always, take care and enjoy the rest of your day.